Hello again. Hello, Julio. Hello, How are you? good evening. Good evening. How are you, Tatiana? Hello. That's okay. Okay, good. Good to see you. Good to see you. Elsa is coming. Emily, hello. Hi, teacher. Hi. Good night. Uh, good evening. How are you? Good, good. And you? Excellent. A little, a little hot, but um, we're doing good. <laughs> I was waiting for the time. Elsa, hello. Hello, teacher. Hello. Good to see you. Are you ready for another exciting uh, class, guys? <laughs> okay. Okay. Yes, I, I am okay. ready. Okay, you are ready and everybody else, I guess. Me? I think so. I think that I'm ready also. Uh, oh, no, 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 no. What is... Oh, here is my first one. Uh, let's see how many people we have now. We cannot wait too much, but uh, just wait. We have, according to my... Um, time over here six oh seven o'clock okay so let's just wait like 30 seconds or one minute in order to present my uh start the class i would like to remind you that sitting up in a good position leaves on a space for uh the notebook or the notepad it's important to take notes okay it's important to take notes so um, in order to uh, be practicing your English. Uh, move your um, your uh, uh, laptop, your computer, or your uh, cell mobile phone a little backward and leave a space over there. Okay, so in order to you take notes. It's hot, isn't it? It's kind of hot, but it's me. Okay, uh, let me show my presentation over there. Meanwhile, everybody else is coming, so we can uh, check it out some things about, for example, the time. Uh, the time, the date, okay? So remember that we are talking about stories and things, and what else? What are the topics? Uh-huh. Yes. Uh -huh. yes. Yes, Glenda? <laughs> okay, A story and things, and you can? But you can buy there you can buy there what what are others the tour. what do tour, you say tourist attra tourist attractions tourist attraction uh-huh yeah the tourist attraction will be the will be i guess tomorrow it will be the second part so it's has to my presentation over there and uh, so right now we're talking about stores. What stores do we have around the city? What kind of stores? Can you mention them? Uh huh. What kind of stores do we have around the city, in the neighborhood, or in the place where you live? Uh huh. Do you remember them? When you need food, where do you go to buy? McDonald's. Ah, okay, but you go to McDonald's. Go, cool. okay, good. So, what is what is uh, uh, this place? How do you call it? A restaurant? You call it a restaurant or a fast food restaurant? Mm hmm. Hey, come on, today you're very quiet, guys. Uh-huh. 
Okay, we have restaurants. What else? Yes. Restaurants around the city. Drugstore. Drugstores. Okay. Uh -huh. Drugstores. What else? Gas station. Gas station where you fuel your car. So in a gas station, you uh, fuel your car. Okay, so bookstore. And a bookstore where anytime you need a book, you need a sharpener, you need a notebook, you go to the bookstore. And what else? Uh huh. A bank. A bank. A bank. A bank. Uh, what do you do in the bank? What can you do at the bank? Remember that yesterday we were uh, studying and checking some the some um, uh, how do you call it birds that we use uh, at the bank and some expressions. What can you do? I I can or or I get um that's that's what money. Okay, you can uh, you can get money from the bank. Uh huh. Uh -huh. uh, maybe I I I can I get uh, uh well, okay you can get money, uh, yeah. money. Check. Uh, you can get a travel check or you can buy a travel check over there and what about your electricity your bills uh what do you do with your bills at the bank you get uh, then or you pay uh, then? What is it? Uh huh. You get. You you get because your bills, your water bills, your electricity bills, your phone bills, and you receive bills are receives. Uh, okay, uh, Emily. Uh, let's see. Emily, thank you for letting me know. Ana Gabriel also. Mm -hmm. Okay. What about a restaurant? What 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 can you do at, at a restaurant? Uh, I I I I buy. I can buy a sandwich. Okay, you uh, can buy a sandwich. Uh, food. Okay. Yeah. Okay, you can buy coffee also. Yeah, you say, okay, um, sorry, I promised that I was going to send you those definitions. I couldn't because I've been all day long out of my house. Estuve todo el día fuera de la casa. Um, but I'll send it to you if it's not during the class, uh, I mean, after the class, uh, tomorrow morning, okay? So, okay. Uh, so today is Tuesday. It's our sixth session and uh, Tuesday, November what? What day is today, guys? 17. Uh, today is the seven. And I would like to seven. remind uh -huh, I would like to remind you also uh, uh, to complete the section three of the in the platform on the platform and the midterm. Remember that if you can advance, you can go ahead, okay? If you feel that uh you can it's not necessary for you to go. Uh, along with me, side by side. So you, if you can adelantar, hágalo, okay? But please work on that. Uh, que les, les uh, motivo a que trabajemos en la plataforma. Okay, so yesterday we were talking about uh, places around the city. What places in the, around the city do you see over there? Uh, uh -huh. What places? What place is in this? Box, bookstore. Okay, supermarket. the bookstore, supermarket. What else, guys, girls? Gas station. Uh, gas station. Uh huh. Name the places that you see over there, please. Okay, the gas station, the bookstore, the drugstore. What else? Uh, the post office. The post office, okay. That nowadays only people send packages. 
at the post office. And no, no more letters, uh, that amount of letters, because we have emails, we have uh, social medias in order to write to someone. Okay, so what is the learning objective, Abel Herminio? The learning objective, what is the learning objective? A notice. Uh huh. The stress in the compound knows. Uh huh. Lead to some natural when saying compound okay. noun. Okay, when saying compound nouns. Good, excellent. So, uh, this kind of exercise is very good. It's excellent for you to increase the vocabulary and to do the proper intonation of the words. Okay. So remember that uh, in order to come uh, to become fluently, we need to practice a lot. It does happen to me, that happened to you, that happened to everybody who learns English as a second language. Okay, the first time, let's listen, okay? Page 87, exercise four, pronunciation. Compound nouns, part A. Listen and practice. Only listen. Notice the stress in these compound nouns. Post office. Gas station. Restroom. Coffee shop. Drugstore. Bookstore. Supermarket. Department store. Okay, so notice the stress and the good intonation that we make to these words. Okay, we're going to do it one more time, but this time, uh, please repeat with no microphone, okay? So try to, desde su casa, detrás del micrófono, en voz alta. No importa que le oigan los vecinos. Aquí me oyen también cuando doy clase. Okay, so let's, are you ready? Oops, sorry. Okay, let's do it. Page 87, exercise four, pronunciation. Compound nouns. Someone help me with Listen the microphone. Someone help me with the microphone. Oh. Microphone, Abel. Okay. Let's do it. Notice the stress in these compound nouns. Post office. Gas station. Gas station. Restroom. Restroom. Coffee shop. Drugstore. Bookstore. Supermarket. Department store. Okay, one more time. Okay, post office. Gas station. Restaurant, coffee shop, drugstore, bookstore, supermarket, department store. Okay. Now, se va a un poquito, a little bit noisy, but uh, open your microphones, okay? Open your microphones and listen and repeat. Page 87. <clears throat> Exercise four, pronunciation. Compound nouns. Part A, listen and practice. Notice the stress in these compound nouns. Post office. Bus office. Gas station. Bus office. Okay, so. Drugstore. Uh, we're a little bit behind of it. So let me make a pause and everybody repeat, okay? Page 87, okay. exercise four, pronunciation. Compound nouns. Part A, compound. listen and practice. Okay. Notice the stress in these compound nouns. Post office. Gas. Okay. Gas station. Gas station. Everybody? The next one. Number three. Restroom. 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 Coffee shop. 
coffee shop. Coffee shop. Coffee shop. Yeah. yeah. Drug store. Drug store. Book store. Book store. Supermarket. Supermarket. Department store. Department store. Okay. Department store. Okay, so uh I will send you this one. I'm sorry that today I didn't because I was out of home all day long. Okay, yesterday we saw the conversation about it. We are just going to listen in order to refresh. And remember that the conversation is, what are we seeing in context over here? Elsa, Cecilia, what are, what are we seeing in context over here? We're studying. We're studying. What? On the conversation? Uh, what is the topic, the grammar forms, or the, or the forms that we are studying on, the, on this uh, conversation? Is Mark over there? C? C preposition. C preposition of place. Of oh, place. That's, this is the last uh, that we did yesterday, okay? So let me, let me just take this one and let's listen. Page 87, exercise three, conversation. It's an emergency. Listen and practice. Listen and read. Excuse me, can you help me? Is there a public restroom around here? A public restroom? Hmm, I'm sorry, I don't think so. Oh no, my son needs a restroom, now. It's an emergency. Oh dear. Well, there's a restroom in the department store on Main Street. Where on Main Street? It's on the corner of Main and First Avenue. On the corner of Main and First? Yes, it's across from the park. You can't miss it. Thanks a lot. Okay, so I will send you to break our rooms in order to practice the conversation. I will send you in group of three, but the conversation is only two, the man and the woman. But I will send you in group of three just in case someone cannot connect. Para toman turnos, uh, practicing the conversation, okay? Even though you are three. Comprende? Yes? Yes, no problem. Okay. How many are we, let's say, how many are we? In group of three, somos 20. Uh, three, six, nine, 12, uh, 16, 18. Seven. Uh, okay, seven, okay, seven. I will give you six minutes, okay? Let me create over here. Thank you for helping with that one. My math is not that good. <laughs> okay. Uh, I will create, uh, okay, seven. Uh, six minutes. Around, um, yeah, six. And uh, it will be, it will be 30 seconds. Okay. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay. One, two, three. Uh-huh. One, two, three. And the last one, it has only two. Okay, so you should be receiving the invitation. Remember that you only have six minutes. Please accept. Okay, I, I can see that some of you are getting in.
Glenda, did you receive the invitation? Do you have the conversation? En lo que estamos haciendo, teacher. Okay. Uh, you, you should have, it's on the manual, okay? Siempre, okay, but let me present the conversation myself because the time is, is very short, okay? So, okay, here you are. My okay. microphone is off, so take turns practicing. Okay. Uh, um, I'm Manny Senior. Okay. I'm Star. Excuse me, can okay. you help me? Is there a public restroom around here? A public restroom? Mm, I'm sorry. I don't think so. Oh no, my son needs a rest restroom. Now it's an emergency. Oh dear. Well, there's a restaurant in the department store on Main Street. Where on Main Street? It's on the corner of Main Street and Prince Avenue. Oh, on the corner uh, of Mainland Pierce? Yes, it's across from the park. You can see. Thanks, Anna. Okay, and, and now uh, with Nubia, uh, uh, you can do a senia or you decide Marvin, neither or you, with Nubia. Teacher, but, but Nubia is driving. Ah, okay. No, and, and never mind, never mind. And then practice Very again. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, excuse me, can you help me? Is there a public restaurant around here? Uh, Senia? A, a public uh, restaurant? Who was first? Mm -hmm. uh, I, okay, I'm Now Marvin, woman. you're the woman. Uh, Senia, you're the man. Okay. Okay. Excuse me, can you help me? Is there a public restaurant around here? A public restaurant? Hmm. I'm sorry, I don't think so. Oh no, my son needs a restaurant. Now it is an emergency. Oh dear. Well, there's a restroom in the department store on Main Street. Where on Main Street? It's on the corner of Main Street and Pierce Avenue. On the corner of Main and Pierce? Yes, it's across from the park. You can miss it. Thanks a lot. Great, fantastic. So we're about to go to the, the main room, okay? Uh, okay. Okay, so it's about 30 seconds and we are out. Okay.
Okay, uh, I forgot to ask you if you had the conversation. Uh, remember that you had to have the manual handy, okay? And the conversation is a little different when oh, we're in, that in from your manual, but it's because of the audio. Okay, so, but were you practice? Were you practicing? Yeah, yes, okay. Fine. Okay, good. Let's continue then. Let's continue. Yeah, we're back to sound and okay. So on the conversation, we are studying prepositional place. We saw yesterday. Uh huh. What is one of prepositional place? You see it over the, there. On the corner on, of the on, other is on the corner of. On the remember, corner. on the corner of. And the across, other, from, across, from. across from so on the corner of on the corner of on and across from across from is almost in front of okay in front of for example I work at Instituto Arce and uh, across from there is Don Pollo okay in front of the instituto, there is a Don Pollo. Okay, it's similar. So you can, you can, you can really, you can use across from, in front of. Okay, and so those are the prepositional place. Now, ah, what is so? We have some vocabulary over there. Okay, the vocabulary is what is it? The first. Uh -huh. What is the first? Public restroom. A public restroom. public restroom. And what is a public restroom, Marvin? Uh, Mr. Mulato Gaitan? What is a public a bathroom restroom? Any, anyone can use. A bathroom anyone can use. Remember that in your house? How do you call it in your house? It is a restroom or do we give a, a, another name in our house? Yes, it's other, other name. And what is the other name that we get, we call it in a, in a house? Which is not bathroom. Food. bathroom, okay? But people say, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm going to the bathroom in a public area. But a real, real, real is restroom, okay? And the other list at the Nilsson is, what is it, the expression? You can't miss it. No, no, the, the ah. expression on the vocabulary. Ah. And? And? Uh, sorry? And sorry? And sorry? I don't think it's so. I don't think so. And what's that? A polite way to to say. Okay, a polite way to say no. I don't know. Okay, that's a way. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't think so. I don't know. Okay, I don't think so means I don't know. Okay, so that will. But this is a very polite. And uh, let's see. Uh, Tatiana, Michelle, what is the other expression that we have over the year? You can? You can miss it. You can miss it. What is it? It's? Hello, Emma. It's easy to think. To find. It's easy to, to find. Yes, it's easy to find. Yeah, you can miss it. It's over there across the street, okay? Good. So these are some expressions, and now we're going to see. Let me just cover this one because, okay. On the grammar, and, uh, Silvia, Silvia, Andrea, what is the uh, prepositional place? What is the learning objective? Practice giving location using proposition of place. Uh, practice given location prepositional place. Excellent. Good. Good English. All of you, of course. Using prepositional place correctly. Okay. So, for example, what is the prepositional place over there? 
What is the preposition of place? A anybody? On. It is on. On. It is on. Yes. A I have someone here that I, I was going to ask. Okay, Jacqueline Lorena, and what is on? Use? Use on Y I Street or Avenue. Uh, Avenue. All along. This is not a specific. Uh, for example, uh, my house is on San Antonio Bar. Where? Any place of San Antonio Bar. Okay, so uh, the street, so it's not a specific. Good. The next preposition, Abel Herminio, it's, what is it? On the corner of. On the corner of. And what is the corner of, uh, Herminio? Use. My. My house on the corner no, of... No, just read the definition over there, the, the instruction. No. Use... On the corner of Y2 Street or Avenue. Okay. Uh, use on the corner of... Remember that we say of... 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 Okay. It's on the corner of... Uh, Second Avenue or Third Avenue, for example. Oh, no, it's uh, for example. Let's say that this uh, this one is the bank, and you say, Mr. Lopez, where is the bank? Oh, it's on the corner of Fifth Avenue and Main Street. Okay, so good. And uh, let's see someone. Um, Ana Gabriela, what is the next preposition? Across from. Across from. And what is across from, Gabriela? Use across from, why, please. Well, Esta tenía una pregunta. Dígame, uh, tell me. En el to, este, on the corner of, no se usa para barrios también. ¿Cómo no? Es, uh, uh, no. No, no, because no. Uh, the, the neighborhood is too, un, uh, too grande. It's only with uh, streets or avenues. Mm -hmm. For example, uh, let's see. Uh, where is Macondo? There is a place called Macondo near my house. And I will say it's on the corner of uh, uh, Second Street and uh, First Avenue, okay? Where is uh, uh, any, uh, for example, uh, Wendy's? Where is Wendy's? It's on the corner of Gabriela Mistral and uh, Los Héroes Boulevard. Okay, it's on the corner of. So it, it's, a, it's a street over here and it's over here. So Wendy's is over here on the corner. Mm -hmm. Thank uh, you. And you're welcome. You're welcome. Any question, guys, please feel free uh, to ask. Lo único que puede pasar que no lo puedo No, please uh, ask me. Sin temor. Okay. So on the corner, across from. Remember that across from, for example, let's say this is the bank. Okay. And you ask me, Mr. Lope, and, and I ask uh, Miriam, where is the what is the bank? Miriam? And you will say, it's... The van, it, it's across from the park. It's across from the park. Bravo and applause. Okay, good, excellent. The bank is across from the park. You also can say it's in front of the park, okay? Like this, okay? But it's across, okay? Good. And the other, uh, the other preposition that we have, uh, Claudia Elizabeth, is, which one is it? Uh-huh. Uh, ah, next to. And what is next to?
What is next to? Use next to with a place. With a place. Use next to. Let's say that this is the bank and this is the supermarket. Where is the bank? Anybody? Where is the bank? The, the bank is next to the supermarket. I said supermarket. Oh, supermarket. Anybody. At, okay. At supermarket. Okay, the bank is next to the supermarket. Okay, the next one. Let's see if, uh, so please, if he, I don't mention your name, so raise your hand and participate. I'm trying to make everybody participate. Tatiana, I guess I haven't asked you. What is the next preposition? Between. Uh -huh, between that's between look over there at the picture guys this is the bank this is the supermarket and this is uh the a drugstore okay the bank and this the bank the supermarket and the drugstore and what it says tatiana use between? Uh-huh. With? With two places. With two places. Where is the, I said that this is the supermarket. Yeah, this is the supermarket and this is the bank and this is the drugstore. Where is the bank? Where is the bank? The bank is between the drugstore and the supermarket. The bank is uh, between the drugstore and the supermarket. So this is the way that we use. I hope that I am tomado nota mientras estamos hablando. So this is the way that uh, we use uh, prepositional place. So prepositions a place. Everybody repeat with um, behind the microphone. On. On the corner of. On the corner of. Across from. Across next to next, next to between. between okay one more time on a little faster on on, on, on the corner of on the corner of, 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 of across from across from next to between between okay so there is uh there are the things over there you see more examples over here listen and pay attention page 88 exercise 5 grammar focus prepositions of place on on the corner of across from next to between the department store is on Main Street. It's on the corner of Main and First. It's across from the park. It's next to the bank. The bank is between the department store and the restaurant. Okay, listen and repeat detrás del microphone and I will make a pause, okay, for you to repeat. Ready? Fingers up. Okay, ducky. Ah, okay. Page 88, exercise 5, grammar focus. Prepositions of place. On. Oops, sorry. Page 88, exercise 5, grammar focus. Prepositions of place. Okay, one more time. On. On the corner of. Across from. Next to. Between. Okay, now the sentences. 
The department store is on Main Street. Repeat. It's on the corner of Main and First. It's across from the park. Try to do it in a normal voice, okay? It's across from the park, okay? It's next to the bank, the next one. It's next to the bank. The bank is between the department store and the restaurant. Okay, so that's, those are the things, okay? So those are, uh, look on the corner of, so you say, uh, this is the place and First Avenue and Main Street. So the department store, it's on, it's on Main Street, I'm sorry, on Main. Then we have on the corner of Main Street and First Avenue. It says it's on the corner of Main and First. Then we have across from, it's across from the park, okay? Like we say over there. Then we have next to, it's next to the bank. And then we have between, the bank is between the department store and the restaurant. So between is used when we have two places. Okay, here is the main place. Then we have another and another. Okay, now let's practice. Let's try to practice. Este es el mismo en Spanish. This is el mismo mapa que tienen ahí en el manual, pero este se ve mucho mejor. Okay, so look at the map over there. We have the gas station. Can you see my pointer? Can you see my pointer moving? Yes, I see. Uh, okay, we have the gas station, doctor's hospital, the hospital. We had the post office. We had the bookstore. We had the department store, okay? And we had the bank, the city bank. And then on 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 Second Avenue we have the drugstore, okay, and we had the supermarket. And then on Main Street we had the department store that I already mentioned, the bank. Ah, oh, on Main Street also we had the restaurant, okay. Here on. On Park Street, we had the movie theater. On Second Avenue, we had the shoe store and the coffee shop. The coffee shop is right on the corner, okay? Or, or, the, or the image, the corner of the image, okay? So, uh, do you have the map over there available? ¿Tienen el mapa del manual? If it's not, uh, uh, please make a capture of this picture over there. Because now we're going to do a, a, an exercise. For example, it says the coffee shop is Second Avenue. It's this, the, the shoe store. Okay. Aquí debe de decir shoe, pero no lo puedo poner porque... Okay, so look, Co one, coffee, the coffee shop is Second Avenue, it's the shoe store. Let's go back to the map. Where is the coffee shop? It's over here. Ah, um, please write down the, the sentences. in your notebook, right? right uh, copy the sentences quickly, please. Okay. In order to do the exercise. Oh, Don Julio, you already got it, right? On the... Can we teach it? Uh-huh. I, I can hear you. Ah, uh, you can hear me? Let, let's see my microphone. 
the microphone. No, no, uh, uh, no, no puse atención cuando preguntamos ah, si me ah, ah, a mí. Ah, write, down, write down the sentences, copy the sentences in order to go back to the map and do the exercise. Don't worry. Is the, uh, uh, Excuse me, I don't have the map. No, that's why. Copy the sentence and then we, I, 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 pro, I will project the map. Okay. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, we have time. I only have uh, 20, 23 uh, uh, slides for this presentation. If we, we do 13 today, it will be fine. We're going with time. Estamos a tiempo. Cabal con el, lo que me di. In order to finish on Thursday. Okay. Yale. Yale tome foto a la pantalla. O sea, no, no, no. Okay, good. I, I needed the map. Yeah, I'm going to project it right now when everybody write down the uh, the, the the sentence. And again, disculpen que no les envié, pero sube fuera de casa todo el día. Mañana en la mañana sí, porque eso voy a hacer. That you can work and practice because English requires a lot of practice. You say maybe, ah, oh, Mr. Lopez, a lot of repetition. Yes, but that repetition make you get the English in a very good way. Tell me when you're ready. I'm ready. Okay, what about the rest? I'm ready, teacher. Okay, good, thank you, Katrin, thank you. Everybody's ready? Uh, let me just get my phone in order to take a picture of the for this one for me to go because I need to project the map. Let me, let me a second. Okay, let's move to the map. It says the coffee shop is Second Avenue. It's the shoe store. Okay, here is the coffee shop. At the corner, at the bottom corner of the thing. Uh-huh. What will be the first sentence? The coffee shop and Second Avenue. Uh-huh. What it will be the sentence? The coffee shop. The coffee shop is on Second Avenue. It's on Second Avenue. Uh huh. And this is the shoe store. It's next to the shoe. This coffee shop is on Second Avenue. It's next to the shoe store. Good, excellent. The movie theater number two is Park and Main Street. Here is the movie street, the, the movie theater. There is, um, uh, okay, uh, they said Park and Main Street. Uh-huh, this is Park and this is Main Street. What will be the first sentence? The movie theater. 
the movie theater is across from Park and Main. It's oh oh no, Park Street. It says Park Street. I'm sorry. Yes, but it, Park Street. This is a, a calle. Park Street and Main Street. Try again, Miss. Miss, try again. It, it was you, Sylvia. Try um, it. Yes. It, look. Shh. This is a corner. This is a corner. Uh -huh, the movie theater is. Everybody. It's on the corner of. It's on the corner of Park, Park and Main. Main. Park and Main. Uh huh. And ah, uh, and this is the park. <laughs> and this is the park. It's. It's across. It's across <laughs> from the park. It's across from the park. So the movie theater is on the corner of um, Park Street and Main Street across from the park. A uh, gas station is over here. The gas station. And this is the parking lot. And this is Center Street. This is Center Street. What will be? Gas station. Across from. across from the gas station is across from the parking lot. Uh huh. It's on Center Street. It's on Center Street. Good, excellent. Uh huh. The next one is ah. It's on the Center oh, Street. Ah no, it's uh, it says it's. First and center. This is First Avenue and this is center. I'm sorry, Miss. Try again because it was my mistake. It says it's First and Center. This is First Avenue and this is Center Street. Mm -hmm. On the, corner, on, the corner, first on, on the corner of it's on the corner of so the gas station is across from the park on the corner of uh first and center good excellent we're doing good you are doing great okay the post office where is the post office here the post, of, the post office is uh center street and second Avenue. Ah, okay, but what is the preposition? Uh, it, is, it is next, next the next to Doctor Hospital. Ah, okay, but uh, what is the preposition? Ah, uh, oh, yes, the post office is on on the Cent Center Street. Um, second Avenue. Aha, uh -huh, but are you missing the pre uh, the preposition of place, Don Julio? Uh, excuse me, on Center. Uh, uh, on, on, second, on Second Avenue. The, uh, on the corner. Uh, on the corner of. On the corner of. Remember that we use it. Uh, uh, it says the post office is on the corner of Center and uh, Second. Okay. Okay. It's it's now, Don Julio. It's next to next. the doctor's hospital. Next to the doctor's hospital. Good. Wow. Excellent. And number five, the bank. Restaurant. Uh, uh, restaurant over here. And the department store. Uh-huh. The bank is the main street on the main street. There are there are two places though, between? Julio. Uh, between the is the bank. bank is between the restaurant and the department. Ah, okay, between. Uh -huh, because there are two places. Okay, Be the bank is between the restaurant and the department store, and now. Between. It, it, no, it, it's Main the Street. Restaurant. No, but it's the the it's second. On Main Street. It's on Main Street, okay? The bank. So you're being, when you say like that one, you're being very specific on the direction that you give to people. So you say the bank is between 
the department store and the restaurant on Main Street. Okay, when you're talking, you don't need to say it's on. You can say the bank is between the restaurant and the department store on Main Street. And that would be a, a very good um, uh, word order. Okay, good. So let's check the answers over there. So we were saying that the uh, shop is on Second Avenue. It's on the next to the shoe store. Sorry, my finger mistakes. And the second you're saying that the movie theater. A ver, let me, tell me. The movie theater guide. We already have this one. So please just tell me. The Look movie theater it. is on park and main. Uh -huh. It is across from the park. Across from the park, okay. What about the gas station? The gas station? The gas station is across from the park. From the park, it's? It's on the corner of the prison center. On the corner of the center. The post office? Is, the, is on the corner of it's on the corner second. of uh, center and second is next to the hospital next to the hospital really really uh, this it's uh, we, uh, we're saying here because of the practice but we say uh, I say excuse me guys where is the post office and you say well it's on the corner of center and second next to the hospital you see Easy, easy, easy. Uh, the bank. It's between the restaurant and the department store. It's between the restaurant and? It's on, on Main, Main Street. Street. On, Main Street. on Main Street. On Main Street. Okay. So remember, remember, um, I'll send you this one. We have this one okay it's important to be get familiar with this terminology over here so use on with i street or avenue and a little bit of spanglish on eh, lo usamos cuando está en una calle pero no en un lugar específico okay it's on 25th avenue for example the let's say hospital rosales a Rosales Hospital, we say, oh, it's on 25th Avenue, Mr. Lopez. Ah, where? Okay, but it's on the 25th Avenue. So get familiar with the terminology. Okay, tomorrow we'll start with a breakout room and I did my research and you're going to practice this, okay? So that will be tomorrow, okay? Uh, so... We will start with, uh, I will send you in groups, but uh, right now, let me, estamos bien con el tiempo. Okay, so right now, let me um, uh, take your attendance. Uh, any question, guys? Any questions? Do you have questions? No, no, I have question. Okay. Okay, remember that uh, it's just a matter of practice, okay? So, uh, let me see your attendance. Okie dokie. A ver. Let me see if I am on the correct one. Uh, Abel Herminio Mendez. Present, Mr. Ana Gabriel Alvarenga. Present. Claudia Elizabeth Aguirre. Present, teacher. Elsa Cecilia Carranza Rodríguez. Present. Emily de Los Ángeles Villatoro. Present. Clenda Elizabeth Antillón Orellana. Present teacher. Jacqueline Lorena Campos Chávez. Present teacher. Julio Antonio Orantes Herrera. Present teacher. Catherine Vanessa Aguilar Romero. Oh, Karen, sorry. Karen Vanessa Aguilar Romero. 
first. Car okay, good. Carla Susena Angel Lopez. Present. Uh, Catherine Andrea Sanchez Diaz. Present, teacher. En Crisia Elizabeth Portillo Chávez. Present. Luis Edenilson Díaz Valle. Present. Marvin Ruby. Ma Marilyn, I'm sorry. Marilyn uh, Ruby Mulato Gaitán. Present. Uh, Marvin Rudy Mulato Gaitán. Present. Uh, uh, Minor Alexander Avelar. Present. Miriam Janet Viator uh, Villalobos Segovia. Present. Nubia Beatriz Rivas Alvarenga. Present, teacher. Robert Adalberto García González. Present. Silvia, Silvia Andrea Córdoba Sarabia. Present, teacher. Tatiana Michelle Pineda Gaitán. Present. En Senia Esmeralda Chávez Lozano. Presentation. Ok, guys. Thank you very much. El es motivo a no perder clases. Gracias por aquellos que siempre se conectan, aunque están en su trabajo. Y también a trabajar en la plataforma. Ok. So, if you feel like you can advance, go ahead. No problem. Bye, bye. Have a good night. See you. Thanks, You're welcome. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. See you tomorrow. We'll see you tomorrow.